Hey guys, welcome back to Chord Hub and today I'm going to teach you the chords of My All by Mariah Carey. And before anything else, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please click the subscribe button and notification bell below because every day we are going to upload daily tutorial. By the way guys, we use a capo here at number 3 fret. So we're going to have an easier set of chords. So for intro, our first chords in a is an A minor so we'll start here then here and here the base of A minor is this A chord here all the way down next is a B7 a B7 is just like this start at the B base then here at the first fret and then here and here Actually, B7 will going to have this one, but for this uh, song, we will use just this three. Okay, this three, and then for the third chord is the E minor, two over here. Okay, and then next is the A minor, back to A minor, and B7. Again for intro. Then okay, uh, and then we will teach you And then, uh, next is I'm going to teach you this one. Okay, first is here at the fifth, fourth fret of the third string. Then down at an open B and an open E. Okay. Okay, that's the first one. Next is again. Then bass A. So we're going to have an A minor. That's the first part. Again for the first part. Next is the B7, I'm going to show to you first. Okay, again, B7. So we'll pick here at the B base all the way down to the second string. Okay, the next is here, the fourth fret, the fourth string. Then next is here. Okay, then open. Then back here. Open again and here. Again. Okay, that's the first part of the intro. Next is back here slide to the fourth uh, fret and same with the first part then next is here again and same but this time then end at the E okay again for the intro Then we'll 
start at the verse. So for verse, still the same, A minor, then B7, and E minor. But this time we're going to have these two times. Then next is the D. Okay, you can use this one without the middle one. Then C major 7. C major 7 is like this. Start here at the third fret and here. Next is B7. And last is the E minor. Okay, we'll play the verse. I'm singing on pattern for beginners it is advisable that you, you can have the downwards it's like that and just start by the base of the every, every every string or every chord like a minor here and b is here again okay next is the last part of the verse is like this. Okay, I'll teach it to you. First is the E bass. All the way down here. And then slide. And then, open and then. That's for the verse, and then we go to the chorus. So for chorus, we're going to have the A minor again, then D7, E minor, and a D, and a C major 7, and then A minor again, and this time a D7. D7 is, we'll start here. And then here and here. The bass is this one. So you don't want you don't need to include this one. Then after the D7, we're going to have a G. And then a C major 7 again. And this time we're going to have an F sharp minor, which is like this. So we'll start at the F sharp bass. And then two over here. Next is an F7, a simplified version of F7, it's just like this. Start at the first fret, the E chord, and this one. Just this two. Next of F7 is E minor. Next is a D. And this time a C major, C sharp minor. C sharp minor will start here at the fourth fret of this fifth string and then here and then here is three. Okay. Then next is back to A minor, B7, and an E minor. So we will play the chorus. I'll be my After that, we're going to have the ad lib, but the chords of ad lib is still the same, so I'll show it to you. B7, 
have this every time we will go back to the E minor and after the ad lib we're going to the chorus and the last part uh, chorus and then the outro so the outro is still the same okay so that's it guys for the course of my all and I hope you like the tutorial thank you and please subscribe